Well, hoping for a repeat. Tonight is the night the Erie Seawolves can win it all. It is game two of the Eastern League Championship Series on the road in Somerset, New Jersey. That is where we find our Isaac Petcash. There he is ahead of the game. Isaac, tell us a little bit about what's at stake, at stake tonight. You know, even Jamison, it's interesting because if you go back two years, the Seawolves were in this same position coming back to Somerset against the Patriots, up one game to none, and then were promptly destroyed in games two and three. But this is a team that's much more veteran-laden than what that team was in 2022. Gabe Alvarez is in his third year, and this team, of course, has a championship under their belts. Now, the key in this game tonight for Erie is going to be getting on the board early. They trailed game one back at home 4-2 in the fifth inning before piling on seven of the last eight runs of the game. But in players that I talked to earlier today, namely veterans Gage Workman, Chris Myers, they said the offense is going to have to come more consistently at the top of the lineup so that starter Austin Bergner can get a bit of a lead, and that would lead to comfortability with the defense. Now, Erie's been here before. Workman Myers have been here before. And for those veterans, it's about them leading the club to set the tone as to what the mindset needs to be for game two about an hour from now. I think everyone that's been here kind of gets it. Um, and I think that kind of rubs off on everybody who hasn't been in this situation. Uh, the overall team just feel is just calm and collected. And uh, I think that's a, that's a huge thing to have on a team and be able to feel that uh, because, you know, emotions don't get too high in, in big time in big time moments. I think that's the offense we've had all year. It's just, uh, we just can pile on at any time. So, um, we just got to put together nine innings and hopefully, uh, hopefully just do what we usually do. Now, as I mentioned for the Seawolves, Austin Bergner gets to make his second playoff start. All he did in the first start in game one against Akron was hurl six no-hit innings in which he set a Seawolves single-game playoff record with nine strikeouts. So Erie has their playoff ace on the mound today. They're not worried about tomorrow. They want to get this done tonight. Coming up at 6 o'clock, I talk with catcher Liam Hicks about what makes Bergner so special and how he can perform well again tonight. Can the Seawolves sweep the series? We'll see if they do. It's back-to-back -back championships for Erie to come home. Live ahead of Game 2 here in Somerset, Isaac Petcash, Erie Sports Now.